Okay. Okay. Something important you're going to see throughout this um, whole healing, and you've seen it through the, all the martial art aspects of the uh, Q show and all the DVDs before, is when we do a revival, we always close up the legs, we fold the hands, we sit the person upright. There's, uh, there's a couple of reasons why we do this, and it's actually quite an interesting phenomenon that happens with the body. The only way these revivals work fully and well is when we sit the person in this position. And I'm going to explain why. I don't have a, uh, a true medical explanation. We have theories which I don't really want to get into, but I'm just going to show you the correct way and uh, the wrong way, okay, and how we found these, again, by accident. Right. Let's take the intermediate lung revival that we had seen earlier. Okay. We had sat the person up. We had leaned them back and placed their palms behind them to stretch out the ribs. But it wasn't just to stretch out the ribs. It's very important that we uh, do this with the palms down and the legs folded so it actually affects the body. Now I'm going to show you the, um, the technique. I'm going to tap so you see the results of this technique. <coughs> okay. It affects the diaphragm, it affects the breathing of the person. Now, seated this way, that works correctly. It will either um, disrupt the person's breathing if they're breathing normally, or if they're not breathing normally, it will correct the breathing. It's again that yin-yang duality, okay? But if his hands, could you place your hands upward? If his hands are not placed palm down on the ground, now I hit harder, but there's absolutely no effect. Okay, could you place your palms down? Just light, you can see that that, that has the effect. I didn't want to do it hard again. Now, also the legs, if you could extend your legs, if we strike, Nothing happens. Could you fold your legs once again? <laughs> There's a huge effect. Okay. Now, the reason why this happens, again, technically and scientifically, we have no idea. We've talked to a lot of doctors and a lot of different um, scientists from different uh, specialities, and nobody can really quite understand it. What we believe is that the body is in such a splayed out um, manner with the legs sticking forward as an example, that you have a lot of nerve on the floor, okay? And that is just like taking the energy and letting it, it go down toward the legs instead of staying into the diaphragm as needed. Once the legs are folded though, it allows the energy to stay in the body more, okay? And it will, it will transfer into the diaphragm more effectively. So these, these are some things that we've seen just through experience. These are not not theoretical. We develop these techniques uh, based on need. Okay, and the immediacy of the need. And that's why the Q-Show healing techniques that we're gonna continue on with are so impressive because they heal in very short time, seconds as compared to minutes or hours.